Zond 7, a formal member of the Soviet Zond program and unmanned version of Soyuz 7KL-1 manned moon flyby spacecraft, the first truly successful test of L-1, was launched towards the moon from a mother spacecraft 69067B on a mission of further studies of the moon and circumlunar space, to obtain color photography of Earth and the moon from varying distances, and to flight test the spacecraft systems. Earth photos were obtained on August 9, 1969. On August 11, 1969, the spacecraft flew past the Moon at a distance of 1,984.6 km and conducted two picture-taking sessions. Zond 7 re-entered Earth's atmosphere on August 14, 1969, and achieved a soft landing in a preset region south of Kustanai, Kazakhstan. Like other Zond circumlunar craft, Zond 7 used a relatively uncommon technique called skip re-entry to shed velocity upon returning to Earth. Of all circumlunar Zond craft launches, Zond 7 would have been the first to make a safe flight for a crew had it been manned. The return capsule is on display at the Orevo facility of Bauman University in Dimitrov, Russia. Topic Notes This article was originally based on material from NASA NSSDC information on Zond 7. Topic External links Soviet lunar images NASA page on Zond 7 NSSDC ID, 1969-067A